What is going on, people of the wild, wild oh, web? Yeah. Had an amazing ski day yesterday with the one and only adventure Rob and Mr. Cooper. Oh. I've never seen anything like this. Give me a hand here. Killed it on the resort yesterday, but uh, there's blue skies today, and you know what that means. We're going ski touring. This ain't Alaska, Rob. This is Pemberton. Let's get after it. Thoughts, feelings? 7.30, feeling stoked. Yesterday evening, Rob and I had one too many beers at Roland's, planning out uh, our trip today. Starting off strong with a rope crossing. Is that thing feeling okay? Well, it gets pretty narrow here. Feels fine, like you're good. You're freaking sideways, dude. I'm slightly horrified. I might shut the camera off and I'll let Rob take over here. <laughs> Not terrified or frightened at all. <laughs> Never been scared in my life. Oh my god. As long as I get myself free from the fucking free from the water, I'm chilling. I'm chilling. I survived. <laughs> Made it look easy. <laughs> Not going for a swim this morning. Like any good West Coast uh, tour. Now we got an hour of dicking around in the trees. So <laughs> prepare yourself. Can't wait. Target. We're going to be standing up there in four hours, hopefully. So this whole area right here is just blown wide open. And that was from a slide a couple of years, four years ago or so, from Joffrey over there. Just wiped out the whole freaking zone. It looks almost like it's just been logged completely. That's a freaking beast, dude. Holy tits. So it's your screw vantage just trying to summit that bad. Side. Yeah, I'd say so. It looks pretty safe. Yeah. <laughs> looks pretty doable for us. This is so gorgeous, guys. Everywhere you look, it's just... We're tucked into the forest again for a little bit, and then we'll start gaining the ridge. Right here, we're looking at the Anniversary Glacier. If you've ever hiked Joffrey Lakes Provincial Park, those lakes are actually on the other side of this peak here, that's Joffrey Peak. So you actually see that from the lakes uh, when you're hiking up. The peak that we're headed to is right up there. So the plan now is we're coming down across this bowl. We're gonna work our way up through these trees, cross and go up this ridge, up those trees, and then work our way up the ridge, yada, 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 until we get to that pretty little summit. On that level eight sweat right now, it's feeling great. Can't even suffer when it's this spectacular out. It's impossible. I don't want to jinx myself, but I've had no nosebleeds so far today. So that's a win in and amongst itself. I think it's time for some sunglasses. Just to think we're only three hours out of Vancouver in another world. Feel so at peace and so stoked at the same time. Touring, boot pack, crampons, we'll find out. Sun's out, the sunnies are on. We're getting tropical out here. I think we got about 400 meters of vert and I couldn't be happier. Let's get it, buddy. Power. So that mountain there, that might be snow spider. I left my skis in tour mode and I left my risers up and they're on my shoulder, which is making this super awkward. This ain't Alaska, Rob, this is Pemberton. We're off the island now.
We're standing here in the middle of the mountains. It's a beautiful bluebird day, and I want to give a huge shout out to this week's sponsor, Ergogenics. This stuff is absolutely lights out. It's the stuff I drink on the way to the mountain. It's the stuff I drink after I'm at the mountain. You guys know I'm a weekend warrior. And the one thing about weekend warriors that's uh, consistent across the board uh, is we focus on our sport and we don't take care of our bodies that well. My diet on the weekends typically consists of barley sandwiches, AKA beer, hot sauce, and typically three to four PBJs. I'm grinding, we're climbing in the mountains, we're burning a lot of calories. And you know what you need when you're burning this many calories? You need protein and you need the occasional vegetable. Ergogenics is all organic and makes it super easy for me to get my protein in and get my veggies in. There's a couple different things I really love from them. In the morning, I love to drink the Adventure Greens. The Adventure Greens is a green powder that's just mixed with six servings of vegetables, covers all you need for the day. And frankly, I don't even try to eat vegetables on the weekend, so I'm feeling so much healthier out here on the mountains. The Ergogenics Coffee Protein Powder, it's absolutely delicious, and it's what you need to keep the day fueled, keep the day fire. This stuff's great, it's organic, it's good for you, it's healthy, it's vegan, it's everything, man. Super stoked about it, and I'm also super happy to have someone supporting the channel, supporting the dream. So take a look at the website. Founder's a great guy, they're based out of Vancouver. Gives a shit about people, gives a shit about the planet. Do me a massive favor, check out Ergogenics to thank them for supporting me. Grab some Adventure Greens, grab some protein powder, Helps me out, helps them out, helps your body out so you can perform at your best. Let's ski down the mountain. We got a beautiful lake kind of kicking around right down there. I can see a logging road in the distance. Looks like this area was logged. Here's kind of the final push before the actual summit. Got the hat on. This is absolutely flipping insane. It's all so angry. We're feeling good. We're trying to stay away from the sides, trying to stay away from exposure. Rob, you feeling good? Feeling great. Right on. Slowly inching our way up to the to the summit. This sunshine is phenomenal. Winter, it's the best. There's Rob. There's a summit advantage. There's a big old cornice. There's the summit. We're just about there. So Rob started to boot pack to the top. I feel like once you get around this corner, you're, it's probably a smooth, just straight up shoot, dude. Rob and I absolutely kicked ass today. Uh, we couldn't make it to the summit, about 25 more meters to the summit, 50 meters, I don't know. We're stoked to follow where those girls ski down and have a kick ass run. I'm gonna get moving down here. A lot of rocks. We missed most of them. Ooh. Where's the first one they looked off? Right here. Oh, no, no problem, dude. Wow. Huh. Holy cow, dude. Me first? Oh, dude, for sure you're going first. Okay, is this thing running? Classic. Woo! Holy cow, dude. Woo! Holy cow, man. Oh! This is the best turn of my life, without a doubt. Wow. Oh, oh, oh. Wow. Good, clear. So sick. This side's a lot steeper. On the rocks, it's a lot steeper. This is beautiful too. Holy cow. Look at Adventure Rob, dude. He's living the dream. Woo! <laughs> that was so kick ass, dude. So kick ass. There he goes. Dropping. Oh, oh, yeah. Oh. 
<laughs> oh, this is the dream, dude. This is the dream. Juice in every turn. Riding off into the sunset. Dude. That was incredible, man. That was incredible, dude. Dude. Super mellow, too. Super mellow. So perfect. Look at these turns, man. Oh. Holy oh. shit. That, was that so would have been good. super epic from kind of like the top, but I'm happy with the line we did. Yeah. Dude. All worth it, man. Wow. Huh. <laughs> you. <Woo>. Oh shit. <laughs> ah. Can't can't, can't beat it. This looks good through here. Yeah, keep it going. Okay. Oh man, so fun. Oh. <laughs> Yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> ah. Too fun. <laughs> ah. Dude, that was so well worth it. I'm feeling very good. Rob, stop harassing the poor dog. Really fun. So good. Yeah, we, we just came down. Vantage around there, yeah. We'll get on out of here. <laughs> See ya. Oh man, I am 10 out of 10. So good in my mind right now. Yeah, I didn't even do my boots up. <laughs> didn't need it. You didn't even need dins for that. The snow is so nice. I didn't even need anything. Didn't even need skis. <laughs> We're off to see the wizard, the wonderful wizard of Oz. Oh, oh, sorry. <laughs> oh, sorry. My bad. Sorry, sorry. Hey, how are you? Just really trying to get to know you. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> Sorry, guys. Thank no you. Worries. You too. Safe travels. <laughs> <laughs> Crazy to look back and think we we're right up there. Who likes to suffer? I like to suffer. I filled the GoPro with water trying to switch a battery at the top. There's so many bushels. I'm just gonna drop the camera. This tree skiing ain't gonna be that exciting. And I'll see you guys at the truck uh, when the suffer is over and done with. Oh, we've made it out of the trees. Those trees, I didn't film them because they were just way too sketchy. Way too miserable, one of the wildest sections of trees I'd ever skied. We were at the bridge. 
I really don't feel like doing this right now. I'm not no, gonna lie. Man. This, this is not, not my energy. Yeah, this is not. Gotta pivot around this tree somehow. Yeah, I was thinking if I fall, I feel like the risk of hurting myself is low. So the risk is like drowning. I mean, you've heard of ski ballet, right? Yeah. It's... What about like ski circus? You know, just like. <laughs> That's what this is. This is complete ski circus. Oh, oh man. Venture Rob making it look easy. My turn. Oh. Well, folks, welcome to the Rise in Alpine Circus. I'm your host, James. And today we're doing the ski tightrope. Or I should say like, welcome to Jackass. I'm Johnny Knoxville and this is the ski log tightrope. As ridiculous as it looks. Here we go. Home free. Time for a beer, Rob Calvin. Yes, sir. It's Rob beer time. That's what ski touring is all about, right here. This is the moment. My heels are locked this year. Yeah. So it's just like, oh yeah, you don't have It's too good. <laughs> it's criminal. <laughs> Literally tastes so hydrating. Oh well, we survived, man. Yeah, no, it's good. I actually deserve it. Until next time, Adventure Rob. Oh, until next time. Resort day next. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I think that's in the cards. Five days of recharge. Yeah. Thanks for tuning in. Keep on shredding. We'll see you next time.